Come with me as I dig up a dinosaur. When we're at the site, we get all our tools together. My favorite tool is using dental picks and a paintbrush. Then we start digging things out. And then if I found a bone, I'd start digging around it and not directly on top of the bone. So most bones are so fragile, we don't wanna just pull them out of the ground. So what we do is we need to cover them first and take them out in a cast, which is just picture paper mache, but we use burlap sacks instead, cut them in strips, soak them in plaster, and make a giant cast. Then do what's called flipping, which is always a big deal. And you flip it over and hope the bone stays inside the cast. We do this because these bones are so fragile, and so the fine-tuning of getting the fossil actually out is done usually in a laboratory setting. The bones are almost never perfect. They're often kind of chipped and maybe even falling apart. It's a jigsaw puzzle with a lot of missing pieces.